Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of our 7 Days to Die series. Today, um, it is just barely hitting morning. We do have a Horde Night coming up today. Um, last episode I was able to get pretty much all of this done. And then I was able to get this whole wall on the top all concreted up. I don't have enough to finish this. So basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to wait until I can get a couple of... Learning elixirs brewed up. I can make a few of them. And then I'm also going to wait until I can get as much concrete as possible. That way I can just learn an elixir, upgrade all of this, and probably get maybe like two or three levels off of it. As for levels, we're not doing too bad. We're level 78, which even in a like a double XP kind of scenario, I try to aim for two levels per day which I mean we're we're not at but I am at um, standard rates for XP so that's okay what I need to do is I need to put one more layer of spikes in here I have 164 that I've been prepping pretty much the entirety of yesterday and then I'm also making a couple more here I'm gonna stop that once um, once the blood moon comes just in case I need to repair something but I think with it going in the both in the workbench and in my inventory, I'll be able to get enough for two layers out here. I do still have some missing here and there from the last Horde Night. And I'm hoping that the zombies don't spawn on the inside. They shouldn't because I have it all framed up now. But there's a small chance that they can still spawn on the frames. I don't think they can, but I am still slightly worried about it. I'm going to go ahead and do this, though. Um, so give me just a couple minutes. I'll probably meet you right when morning hits, and I'll have two layers, of, just about two layers of spikes done here. So I'll be right back. Ah, I see. I had a couple of missing spikes here and there, and I was just like, what came through here? And um, must have had a little uh, dog horde. I actually had to craft a stone axe because I don't have my nail gun on me, so I had to... <laughs> I just pinged one of the concrete or one of the asphalt blocks that was over there and made myself a stone axe so I didn't have to go back into my base. So that was a little bit weird, but um, I guess if I'm down there or if I'm away, I'm not really facing this side at all. Um, I'm going to go ahead and keep doing this, though. I just thought it was kind of funny, but uh, I'll be right back. All right, I pretty much ran out of spikes here, and I thought maybe I'd go over the plan just a little bit today. Um, since Blood Moon is tonight, I don't really want to do too much. I do kind of want to get another level, just because I'm at 92% mobility. Um, and if I can get another point into the light armor, I'll be at 100%, I'll, and I'll be just flying through everything. And... Um, that way, if I do have to run, it shouldn't be an issue. I, there shouldn't be anything that can outrun me at 100% mobility, especially because I did I have um, a college jacket. So that would be great. I don't think I'm going to do any sort of tier 5 quest from the trader. She does restock today. I might just go to the, like the town. I haven't actually taken out my 4x4 yet. A couple episodes back, I did end up purchasing one of those because she had one. And I had a lot of spare dukes because I haven't really been finding anything worth buying. I've just been selling all of my loot. And I don't really run um, anything other than club and shotgun. I do like keeping one of each weapon. Just uh, like AK, um, pistol and a like a some sort some sort of marksman but um i anything pretty much like level five is what i've been getting a ton of and so i've just been selling it pretty much non-stop let's go ahead and put this away here real quick um i've have this many dukes and i bought two forgetting elixirs in recent episodes i have just found absolutely nothing to buy honestly i might just buy another forget an elixir and spec out of be better burger because the secret stash really hasn't been giving me anything and that would give me an extra five to eight points what does charisma or not charisma daring adventure need what oh it's not going to tell me 
Um, I'll have to look and see what Daring Adventure 4 costs normally. I think it's intel intellect level 8. I'm not 100% sure there. But if I could spec out of Better Barter, I wouldn't be opposed to doing it. And then, again, that would give me five extra points that I can put somewhere else. Um, I'll see what the trader has today. I'm actually going to go ahead and, well, let me take all of my sellables from the last couple of days. Yeah, this is all the stuff I've pretty much been getting from um, just the tier 5 quests. It's mostly like level 4 and 5 stuff, but that it really adds up, especially because I do have the Magnum book where I get like a 5% better, better deal, I think. Yeah, 5% better deal. And um, I don't really ever pop any of those candies like the sugar butts i do have them and i think i can make the awesome sauce no i can't i cannot okay that's fine but um if i really ever need to buy anything then i feel like i could just get rid of this i'll i'll think about it but i definitely think what i want to do is pull out the old four by four grab a load probably a whole stack of gas i'll go to jen and then I think I'm just going to go ahead and loot the whole town for today. And we'll see how that goes. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and wait for her to open. And I'll meet you there. Sitting here waiting for the 10 minutes for Jen to open. Kind of just like brings gives me flashbacks to retail. Where there would just be a mob of people waiting at your door for you to open. And you just know you're going to get flooded with people. This Jen's probably just like, oh, god, not this person again. Jesus Christ, I'm really. Um, because I typically just sell stuff to her. I never even buy anything. She's just like, ugh. Okay, let's get all of my stuff prepped. Let's throw these plant fibers out, because I don't think... Yeah, there's nothing in here that I really want. Jen! Let's see. Let's just pop. Oh, I don't have any. <laughs> I left all my dukes at home because I know I'm going to get a whole bunch off of this. So let's go ahead. Oh, yeah. I had, um, I got, never actually was able to turn in my shotgun messiah quest yesterday. So let's grab the steel armor. And then I actually think I need a better impact driver. If anything, it sells for a ton. So I'll go ahead and grab that. What jobs do you have? Anything nearby? No, I'm not going to even worry about it. Let's go ahead and sell all this stuff real quick here. Yeah, 16,000 dukes off of that. That was nuts. And I could sell this for more. What do you got, Jen? Anything reasonable? Nope, that's all stuff. What lucky goggle? Nope, that's plus four. I think they only go up to plus five now. A level one steel club. Ooh, yes! I'm gonna... Oh, that's expensive. Whew! <laughs> what else do you got here? Sniper one, batter up one. I don't so think much. I have batter up one, again. actually. Let's see. I don't. Okay. Maybe next Let's... Time I'll have what you you know what? She's got sugar butts. Let's buy them. Not that I'm, like, a huge cheapskate, but I don't, I think there's a bunch of stuff in here I want, and I don't really feel like going back home. Okay, let's buy this auto shotgun. Let's buy the, let's see, where was it? Batter up one. I think I already have the steel armor schematic. Thanks now so let's see, do I have the... And tell your friends. Was it the Sniper Volume 1? Okay, I do have that as well. And then, what else did you have for books? Um, Urban Combat 2, I already have. Spear Hunter, I'm not really going to worry too much about. Needle and Thread Volume 5, that's what I want to look. Needle and Thread, let's see, Volume 5, I don't have that. So let's go ahead and buy that as well. Lord knows the second I've bought all of these things, I'm going to find something in one of these places somewhere. Okay, 
I've got a little bit of time left on my sugar butts. I'm not too worried about it. I mean, I could just run home, grab some more dukes, and see if they ha if see if um Hugh has anything else. But I honestly got what I wanted off of that, uh, which was a better shotgun. Uh, of course, I still need a level six, but this is definitely an improvement. Um, let's see. I think I'm just gonna go house to house over here. Honestly, I don't. Oh, yep, there it goes. I don't have too much else to do except wait for my spikes to go. Ah. Hello. I'm gonna get rid of you. You were fine with my motorcycle, but no more. I might also use the impact driver on this car here, too, because it's kind of in the way. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Got my fancy new driver. We got. Okay, that does a decent amount. This thing guzzles gas, though, I will say. Alright, let's just stop at house number one. Have I already looted this place before? I don't know. Oof. Oof. Wow. Survey says probably not, because that was lag and a half. Come here, buddy. I do 10% more damage now. You don't stand a chance. Let's grab this car while I'm at it, too. That doghouse is a little unnerving as well. Alright, well I think this place isn't going to be too fantastic, so I'm going to go ahead and clear it, and I'll meet you up at the top. I should say bottom of the house, because this was one of the ones where it is a top to bottom clear. Um, no idea how to get out of here. I think I'm just going to go through the door. Yep, that's fine. I did um, find, out of that, a n another level 6 military helmet. And that one I think I'm just going to repair and sell. I'm actually going to head back to the trader, because I still have 3 minutes left of my sugar butts. And I can sell back that auto shotgun, my level 3. And then I can also sell that military helmet for a little bit. So I'm going to go ahead and do that here, and I'll meet you back in town. I did actually get a level up off of uh, selling all that stuff to her, so I should be at... Not, that's not what I want. Ah, 94%. I'm getting there. I think if I can get a couple points into the, uh, into the heavy armor as well, it'll be better. But I think I want to go into the club perk. I'm not 100% sure. Oh, that's neat. Um, you don't break the smaller things here with the um, with the 4x4. Maybe I'm just bad. You know what? Let, let's go to the creamery, actually. Let's make this tight corner. Perfect. I am the best driver. I've never actually looted one of these before. Let's go ahead and drop off all of my stuff in this uh, here real quick. I'm going to try to not use, uh, not use shotgun ammo if I can help it. Of course, if something ends up hitting the fan, then I'll probably have to. By the way, let's also reload that, just in case. Um, I'm pretty much good when it comes to um, fighting stuff and not ending up having to use any ammo. Because a lot of this stuff I can typically just melee, and um, it's good enough. There are a couple of times where I do get a little bit overwhelmed. Hey, buddies. You're running. You're all running. All three of you. Nice. Ah, oh, this extra 10% bonus is nice. Because a lot of these guys end up, uh, end up living on, like, one health. And then I just have to take them down. I can't, obviously, I can't see that they're living on one health, but that's what it feels like. It takes an extra, just, little tiny whack to hit them. Let's see, where are you guys coming from? Here. Can I just whack you? Neat. And Flurry of Blows, I was able to get that done, and that has helped significantly. Um, I'm just able to swing and swing, and getting 30 stamina back every single time I get a kill is fantastic. I don't actually think there's anything in those, so I'm not even going to bother. I don't think there's anything downstairs. I think I have to keep going up here. I don't know what kind of, like, what tier of quest this actually is. Is there anything behind here? There's a door. Okay. Birdies? Where you at? No? Nope. Don't go there. Jump over here. And I say hello to the little Oh, you just whacked again. Hi. Oh, I missed. 
Has anybody actually, like, gotten killed by a crawler? Or are they just kind of a nuisance? Anything in here? I mean, I guess. I'm not really gonna worry about all that little stuff here. What's in here? Ah, uh, just a medical pile. Okay, that's fine. Let's just keep going up here. Hello? More business? That's not a businessman. You're not a businessman either. That was slightly disappointing. Uh, do you think I can make this? No. Oh. Where am I? How am I? Oh, that's annoying. <laughs> I'm just gonna have to make one of these here real quick. And then can I put it on top of here? I can. Okay, so we're fine. Let's just keep going. Remake my spikes. Nope, I don't have time for that. Excuse you. I'm trying to craft something. You guys are so rudely interrupting me. And I keep missing because I'm talking. Go back to my spikes. Let's just make my spikes. That's all I want to do. Oh, neat. This will be a good thing here. Okay. Share my box. Let's just check the weapons bag. I'm thirsty. I honestly thought that was a zombie coming for me. And not gonna lie, I may or may not have peed myself a little bit. Okay, let's go down. Grab this backpack while I'm at it. I don't have all my dukes on me, otherwise I'd just jump. Oh, almost had to just jump. We should be good just jumping there. Down and out. Okay, let me go ahead and get make my way out of here, and I'll meet you at the next house. I'm gonna go in this house, because the door's wide open, and that feels like a very inviting sign. Hello! Where are you guys? Oh. I think... Is that a... Yep. I was like, I heard a tiny, um... Oh, excuse you. Oh, you're not dead. That's fine. Hey, you're gonna... You just gotta... Oh, there you go, buddy. Just takes a little bit of effort. Ah, yes, all of that for some level 6 padded leggings. Neat. Ah, what else could I really expect? Food. I'll take some food. What's behind here? Desk safe? Wall safe? No. Not worth my time. Ooh, peas. I will always take peas. Ah, uh, these aren't too... Nothing too fancy. Hey, buddy. Oh, that didn't kill ya. Really? Oh, hey. Oh, neat. Oh, this thing is just fantastic. Hey, cop buddy. Ah! Oh, I've already looted this place. That's okay. I missed this. Ah. Do I just, uh... Okay. Okay. Well, none of these houses are, like, super interesting. There's a cop here and there. A white here and there. But I feel like I can handle myself just fine. So I'm gonna go ahead and... Ooh, get that. And then probably just run to that airdrop and head home. Um, I'm almost done with this, actually. Hello, whitey boy. Nope, you're still not dead. That's okay. I keep wanting to be like, yeah, I'll just do this real quick. And then, uh, something happens, and I'm just like, just kidding. I can't do this real quick. Uh, what do I need for that? Sure. Let's just, uh, do that. Let's cat food. Don't need the cat food. Not dropping that stick of dynamite. I'll use that later. What's in here? A baseball bat? Oh, what can I throw up? Sham. Uh, scrap that. And let's go ahead and get out of here. Go to that airdrop and make our way back home. Oh, that lovely feeling when your airdrop is literally just like right next to your base. Oh, ho, ho. Ooh, military armor schematic. Good thing I already have level fives of everything. And I already have it. Okay, that's fine. I can go ahead and sell it. Um, let's see. I did also find an ergonomic grip, and I put that on my club here. So, that is gonna be pretty beneficial, because it lowers the stamina cost even further. And, you know, I think, honestly, I know I've spent so much time on this base. <laughs> But I kind of want to just grab all of the mega crushes that are in my, uh, that are stocked up and, um, <laughs> just run the Horde Night tonight 
and see how it goes. I really think that it'd be fun. Because, um, of course, I haven't been stressed out enough with finishing my base and everything like that and them spawning inside. But let me go ahead and sort my inventory out. And I think I'm going to make my way over to Trader Hugh. I'm not going to pop a sugar butts. I'm going to bring one just in case he's got something I want. But um, I'll meet you there. I got all the way over here and I forgot my dupes. <laughs> oh, well, I'll just check and see what he's got. Uh, probably nothing too great. I'm never super optimistic about anything. He's got a level 4 auto shotgun. It's a very good thing that I checked Gen first. There's some treasures 3. I think I already have that one. Urban Combat, I have. Um... Quit wasting my time. Oh, shut up. I don't have that one, so... I might look at getting that Wasteland Treasures. Mining 4, I don't think I have either. I, I know I have Hunter's Journal 1. Let's see, Mining 4. Yes, I don't have that one. And, um... I'm pretty sure that was the other, the only other one I need. Uh, do you have anything that's close by? <laughs> no. Me? Have a quest that's close by? Oh, you know what? Let me double check and see if his ammo crates have respawned. Because those munition boxes would be super helpful. Um, just in case I need to, like... If I can get a couple of things to sell. Oh, ho, ho, ho. nice. Oh, that's wonderful. Today is just great. It is a great day. Workbench schematic, I can sell that and then possibly get that schematic. Let's see. Let's grab this here. What's in it? Level 4 pump, I can sell that. And I don't really care about the garbage. I care about this cardboard box, though. 15 ish. 15 ammo. Yeah. 15 whole ammo. That's the word I was looking for. And then sneak under there. Grab this chest here. Some shotgun shells. I'll never say no to shotgun shells. A piece of glue. Again, I can't really complain about that. An auger. All stuff that I can sell here. Alright, so I don't even have to make another trip. I should just be able to point my gun at Mr. Hugh and tell him to give me what he's got. So I'm going to go ahead and buy all that stuff, and I'm going to wait. going to wake? I'm going to wake up. I need to wake up. I'm tired. I'm going to make my way back home. Actually, I might buy the sniper rifle. I realized <laughs> halfway through um, when I was buying stuff that I actually didn't forget my dukes. I didn't even look in my inventory, and I had them just sitting there. Um, either that or, or I sold all of that stuff for 12,000 dukes. Um, but he doesn't want the shotgun, so he's not worth my time. But I think I might, yeah, I think I'm going to take the sniper rifle because it, even though it's less damage than my hunting rifle, it's got 13 shots. So I think, yeah, I'm going to grab it. Okay, let's go ahead and make my way home. All right, I just made it back home, and I'm going to go ahead and finish placing up these spikes just in case I decide that it is uh, time to hunker down in here. But I think I, think I do want to do a, uh, <laughs> um, a run where I'm just completely on the ground and not get pushed off. I definitely wish I could get another point in um, light armor. So I might craft a learning elixir and um, upgrade some concrete. I do have like 8,000 or so that I've uh, had in the making. And I do need to go mine some more stone. But I will do that later. Um, I'm going to go ahead and place all these spikes here real quick. And hopefully not get jumped by anything while my back is turned. But I will meet you here with a decision probably after I've popped a learn elixir and uh, done a little bit of concrete. Alright, I was able to get a little bit of this done. I also did get that level up and I still have a little bit of concrete to spare. I'll have to look back into the video and see exactly how much concrete I can do with one learning elixir and I probably will just save these and uh, just pretty much do all of this with like one learning elixir and then I'll go for it. Um, I think a wandering horde spawned just outside while I was doing something because I heard some of my 
spikes break, which is not very nice. Let me just go ahead and grab my nail gun again. Probably gonna go off, uh, have to go out and repair some things real quick. Let's see what they did. Yeah, they were like right out here, I'm pretty sure. Let's see if there's anybody still wandering around. No. Nope. You guys just did a number on my spikes and then walked away. Is that it? Oh, rude. Oh, no, there's somebody over here. Hello? Oh, hi! Aw. Thanks for damaging my spike. Why couldn't you just come down like a normal person? Okay. I think I'm gonna go ahead and grab some ammo just in case. And I'm going to make my way out a little bit here and I'll meet you at 2200. All right, I did put the burning shaft mod on my club just because it'll do a little bit of extra damage. And I realized that I put all these points into <laughs> the light armor and I have the book that um, armor doesn't slow me down while I'm in combat. But that's okay. I've got some Mega Crushes on me just in case. I've also got a health bar just in case. And then I've got some first aid kits and some painkillers. Again, all just in case. Um, I brought as much ammo as I physically could. And then a splint just in case I break my leg. And um, a couple Molotovs. Again, just in case. But where are they coming from? Oh, wow. I got military zombies. I got you guys. Let's go ahead and whack ya. Get ya out of here. Hello. That's a puppy. Hi, puppy. Oh, I whacked something else. Run and then just keep going. Oh, this is exhilarating. And every single time I get a kill, I get the stamina that I need to pretty much refresh everything. So we're good. We are just living. Neat. Hi, puppy. Oh, you're not a puppy. You're not a puppy either, I missed. You guys are doing a lot of whacking, aren't ya? I'm only- oh, you sprained my leg. Oh, time for a Mega Crush. Oh, look at that! Don't break my leg, though. <laughs> I am just human. These dogs tend to break the legs the most, though. All right, let's just whack you here real quick. I don't know who I kill and who I don't. <laughs> oh, this is great. Oh, abrasion. That's okay. Oh, I missed. When I'm moving this fast, it's hard. Oh, let's just do that real quick. Stop my bleeding. Oh, hi, puppy. like trying super hard to focus while also <laughs> trying to commentate. <laughs> I'm stunned too. Let's go ahead and pop a painkiller too. Get my concussion. I'm infected. Man, you guys can't even keep up with me. I keep getting whacked every now and then just because I miss. Oh, hi spider. Let's back up a little bit. Go and grab a couple of you guys here. Oh, let's miss. Is that another dog? No. Oh, how long is this? Uh, 35 seconds left on this. Um, so I need to make sure to pop another one here in just a bit. After all my Mega Crushes go away, I might just have to uh, run back inside. Because a sprained leg is not something that I want to deal with um, running from a horde. Hello. Give me that stamina back. I get like 40 stamina back per kill, so it's super great. Suffered another abrasion. Ah, you broke my leg. All right, let's pop my pop my stuff here. I'll go back home. Ah, uh, that was fun while it lasted. Let's see. Oh, you none of you are really catching up to me too bad. You are, but that's okay. Ah, uh, I'm a little sad they broke my leg. But that's okay. <laughs> Let's just go home. I've got tons of stamina left on me, so we should be well and good. 
let's go ahead and pop you open, pop you close. Let's wait for all you guys to come over here. Let's grab my splint also. Okay. Are you guys gonna actually, you guys are gonna try. Hey, I can just pop you a couple times here and there. Oh. Well, I mean, if I just, if you guys are just gonna keep missing, then I really don't have any need of dealing with you if I just stand still. Ah, yeah. Go all over those spikes. Oh, did something despawn under me? That must have been it. Oh, hi, spider. Hi, spider number two. Spider number three? Jesus, there's so many of them. Oh, here you go. No. <laughs> You dead? Alright. Where are you coming from now? Just, yep, stay right there. I'm gonna have to... Mm, that's not good.
other cop decided to take a little wee on me. Jesus, can you guys like... Let's chill. It's morning. It's already morning. Stop coming. Whatever. I'm just gonna finish you guys off. I'm over here. I'm almost running into this bike. Okay. Is that all? Are we done? We good? All right. I th what? <laughs> Miss, ma'am, you're so late to the party. Okay. Let me go ahead and grab my looting goggles real quick. Let me put all of my ammo and stuff away. Have a clean inventory to go ahead and loot all the stuff. I'll be right back. Okay. I figured I'd start with these. I'm not gonna pop the candy here because these two aren't really worth it, and that'll just uh. Add to extra time. Can I really not grab this? Okay, yeah, I can. Magnum Enforcer. What's this one? Volume 1. Do I have that? Oh, neat. That's my book. On the gun that I don't use. <laughs> I think only two loot bags dropped over here. I'll have to double check, but um, I think we should be alright. Because I didn't actually kill too many of them over here. And I did get an extra point, so what I think I'm going to do... Um... I have level... One. I don't really think I need all of that yet, so let's put some into the pummel here. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Just so, hopefully next Fortnite, I can um, do a little bit more on the ground because uh that was pretty fun not gonna lie <laughs> i had a lot of fun doing that um willingly emphasis on willingly <laughs> it's one thing uh getting um getting knocked off it's a whole nother thing just saying i'm gonna go for it is this a generator bank ah uh, i think i already have that that's okay i can always just go ahead and sell it Let's see, I got a couple of bags here. I don't have any single place where they all congregate. They're kind of just littered around here. And I don't, I think I got like one or two cop bags that are kind of chilling out and about. Why do all of these guys seem to drop in really inconvenient places? <laughs> I don't think, oh, <coughs> just uh, run over some spikes here. Don't mind me. I don't think uh, these are going to give that what that great stuff. I just bought that level 4 impact driver. Gosh dang it. I knew that was going to happen. A hazmat mask. Not bad. Oh, there's a bag. No, is that just a... That's just a corn plant. I really should tear out all this corn, but I, <laughs> I just can't be bothered at all. There's just like a uh, magnum enforcer. I know I already have those. At least I'm not going to be confused about that. I um, think there's a couple more bags here and there, and then that's about it. I do want to get into the Lucky Looter books, because I think the last book is I get more bags. Can I even get to this one? I mean, I can if I try to, if I want to die. Can I just make some frames? When in doubt. Ah, that still hurts. That's okay. So hopefully, there shouldn't be anything else over here. Yeah, that looks like it was all of them. Okay, what'd we get? Uh, Shotgun Messiah 6. I think I already have that one. Pretty sure. Like, 80% sure. Yep. Spear Hunter. I don't really care. I know I already have that. I'm pretty sure I can already make a generator bank. Yes, I can. Spear Hunter. Level 2. Yep, I already have all of that stuff. Okay, nothing super interesting. As for loot, I'm pretty happy with what I got for loot today, just from the traders and from doing a couple of, uh, just grabbing that level 6 pistol. That was definitely a good upgrade, even though I didn't use it. Um, I always like having two rapid fires and then my main, my main two weapons over here. And then always, of course, like the sniper. Um, so I'm gonna definitely, oh, I got two pieces of hazmat. 
I don't think this actually does anything. But I kind of want to save it. <laughs> I don't know if you guys do that where it's just like, I don't need this, but I kind of want to just keep it. <laughs> I definitely hoard a lot of things that I probably shouldn't. Let's see, nerdy glasses. I'm pretty sure this is all standard. Yeah, let's go ahead and just drop that off in there. Drop that off, and we're good to go. All right. Fortnite was pretty success successful. I'm happy with where we're at. The demolishers were a semi-pleasant surprise. I wish I, again, I wish I had the electric fences up before that, but it's okay. They didn't do too much damage to the base. They just took out a couple spikes, and that's nothing a good one to two hour well, one to two in-game hour mining session won't replace. So I'm going to go ahead and end the episode off here. If you guys like the video, feel free to leave a like down below. If you really enjoyed it, feel free to subscribe. Anyways, thanks everybody for popping by. Catch y'all next time.